So we got super speed. Okay, so we're going to check out the demo for this game. Yet another zombie survivors game. It's on Steam for $9.99. I have seen it on sale for $7.99. Uh, so we'll see if it's worth that price point, uh, in my opinion. And then you can judge for yourself. So let's check out the game. All right, here we have our game screen. It does have controller support, which is nice. So it's made by Awesome Game Studio. There's their information. Um, let's get right to it. So select your team leader. So we have SWAT, tank, engineer, and the demo. So these guys are locked, huntress, ghost, and medic. So it looks like more characters are gonna be added. So that's pretty cool. Uh, it gives you a little backstory for each one, uh, what they do, increase uh, reload speed, armor, and skill cooldown. So I'm gonna start with uh, SWAT, our dude perfect guy. So only modes in demo are the isolated city in the default uh, standard 20 minutes. Everything kind of blanked out there. All right. So standard lasts up to 20 minutes, survive the night until dawn. All right. Um, so I played a little bit. You can't reset your stuff. Uh, we'll just get into it though, it doesn't really matter. Isolate City. Now this top down view. Uh, it defaults to auto fire, you can take that off in the options. You're gonna grab these coins to get your power ups going. So we'll try to kill zombies as quick as you can. So you roam this like s small city map area. And then you make yet another zombie defense game which is a black and white game uh, kind of like a tower defense where you build after every wave uh, this game is different it's more of the survivor type where you just go into the time limit so let's grab all this gold it does look nice it's definitely an improvement from the last game graphic wise all right we'll go grab helicopter strike because it looks the coolest so it's on the cooldown. So everything is automatic. So here it comes. All right. So you start out with your team leader and you're gonna get SOSs to get the rest of your team members. Uh, you also have upgrades. So if you make the 20 minutes or if you don't, at the end, they're gonna be stuff you can unlock to improve your character, so that's nice. All right, so hopefully we'll get the SOS here soon. Let's do a um, grenade trail. So if you like these type of games, I think you would definitely like this one. Now for me, $10 for this type of game is too much because the gameplay, it's a, it's a nice pick up and play. I don't know how long I would sit there and play it over and over again. Uh, let's do um, over critical. So you get power up cases and uh, power ups by killing zombies. And little perks like that will, will show up. SOS detected. I'm going to try to get over there as fast as possible. So now we get our team members one at a time. We'll get a, a tank, the shotgun. So we can increase the shotgun. We're gonna grab minefield instead. Just to try to show more of the, the different perks. Again, everything is on the cooldown, so here comes the helicopter. Grab some money. So here's the landmines, try to run the zombies into it. Um, be an auto fire though. There we go. Uh, saw blades. So now we have a saw blade that circles around the party. Now we're waiting for that last SOS. Uh, we did take some damage, so you want to get the hearts. Now 
and stronger zombies will show up as the time goes on. Uh, so you got some health regen, ability damage, uh, magnet range to pick up stuff. Increase our ability damage. Have some more money. And our engineer hopefully should be showing up soon. I don't know like how that works. Like when and why these show up or like the time frame. Alright, so there's our green arrow. So that is the SOS. Uh, this chopper's gonna do a lot of damage, it's gonna be cool. Alright, so now we have our engineer. So they stay in that little squad formation. And we'll play long enough to see some boss zombies here. So like a super power up to mag magnet that you get all your gold quickly. So that worked out well because the helicopter just like wiped out that middle part. Killing Frenzy, which increases your fire rate for a little while. Uh, the demo looks like it does glitch. Hopefully it won't crash. Uh, glitch right here. So I'm sure in the full game they've worked that all out. So we got super speed. So now we have that, like, um gas zombie right there has, sh has shown up so of course the longer it goes the more chaotic it gets uh, coffee cup yeah I think so being fast is always important Big guy should show up pretty soon. So we got another SOS. So I'm guessing when in the full game you have the other three people you could swap out. Because I believe you only can have three max on your team. And so being level or maxed out on your team, you just liberate, I think. Oh no, wait. Minefield. So we're at the five minute mark. I mean I see why it's on auto fire. It kinda takes away a little bit of like gameplay to me so it's nice you can turn it off so we got this big guy here with this like <laughs> axe but not being for uh, manual f like fire see two team members are kind of shooting not concentrating on the big guy so I would like to be able to concentrate all firepower on like the boss battles But it works out fine. Same kind of Pac-Man premise where you just run around with the one joystick. Uh, let's go shotgun. Took a lot of damage there. Oops. So yeah, so uh, I think he just showed up. Maybe. Nope. Try to get to that heart. It is nice that like it blinks where to go. Like that, I saw that red heart was up there. Hopefully, some health is in here. 
do that. Yeah, so it's, it plays well, minus the glitching, which I probably is not in the full game. Alright, I'm trying to wait for that like juggernaut guy to show up. Maybe because so much is going on on screen it locks up, I don't know. Alright. Super speed. Doesn't feel that fast though. Definitely want health regeneration. Okay. So this is yet another zombie survivor. Yet another zombie survivors game. Ten bucks. There's another boss. So it is some chaotic fun. Just pick up whatever. And it is random like what boss zombies are gonna come out at what time it looks like, because I played this earlier and like a big like juggernaut kind of zombie boss came out like way before any of this you can pause it whenever you want so nice so i like it um 10 bucks for me no if you like this type of game probably it's a yes uh, when it goes maybe five bucks i think i i might grab the the full Full game. You have your stats here, which is nice. Uh, that's like your skill tree, I think, over here. You know, this is where you're current at, where your power-ups are doing right now. All right, and continue. All right, we're getting caught up in playing the game and not talking, so back to the main menu. And then after you're done, you'll be able to upgrade different stuff. Um, your upgrade tree, train your survivors, endurance, charisma, strength, intellect, agility. You can reset your points. Well, that's all cool stuff. So yeah, definitely not a bad game at all. Uh, I'm not going to really score this game nine, 1 out of 10 because it's a demo. And the demo is very good. And uh, appreciate them putting it out so you can decide if you want to buy it or not. Uh, if it goes on sale a little cheaper, I think I will probably pick it up. Uh, just right now at 10, I don't think... It's not my type of game where I'd spend 10 on it, but that's just me. Uh, definitely check out the demo so you may decide to pick up the full game. Uh, thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night wherever you are. Please remember to hit that like button and subscribe. Mm -hmm.